Hey, how's it going everybody? It's Ejecta, and welcome to Roblox. Today we're going to check out Bee Swarm Simulator. So it pops right up with the tutorial, gives us our welcome, and it tells us in this game we collect pollen from flowers and make honey. This is actually a pretty long tutorial, 36 pages. But you don't do it alone, you are the leader of your own personal swarm of bees. To hatch bees, walk up to an unclaimed hive, honeycomb, and press claim hive. Open the egg menu, then click and drag an egg onto one of the honeycomb cells. And it looks like we discover different types of bees. Once you have your bees, walk into a flower field. Click or hold the mouse button down to collect pollen. Your bees will automatically collect pollen from flowers nearby. After a while, your bees will get tired and return to your hive to sleep. After they wake up, they'll come find you. As you collect pollen, the meter on your backpack will fill up. When it's full, return to your hive and press make honey. Your bees will begin making honey from the collected pollen. Use honey to buy a faster scooper, a bigger backpack, or more bee eggs. Be careful, some flower fields have hostile bugs and monsters in them. If they kill you, you lose all the pollen in your backpack. You can attack monsters yourself, but your bees will defend you. Discover new types of bees by hatching eggs and transforming bees with royal jelly. There are many different types, all with different strengths and abilities. Some boost the pollen you receive from flowers of a certain color. Some collect pollen from many flowers at once. Activate your bees' abilities by collecting the tokens they spawn. Combo abilities to boost their power. To see a bee's stats and abilities, click on its face in the bee menu. There are bears around the map who have quests for you to do. You can tell they have something for you when you see a exclamation mark symbol in front of them. To talk to a bear, walk onto the platform in front of them and press talk to bear. Quests they give you will be listed in the quest menu. There you can see which task you have to complete and how much progress you've made. Completing quests is a great way to earn honey, eggs, and more. As you hatch more eggs and discover more types of bees, you'll be able to do more things. Gates with numbers on them require you to hatch a certain number of eggs to pass. Platforms with magnifying glass icons require you to discover a certain number of bee types to activate them. You can see how many bees you have and which types you've discovered in the bee menu. Grow your hive to work your way to the very top of the mountain. Good luck. All right. Well, that was a lengthy tutorial. So it looks like we have a hive. We can pick any of these hives. So I am going to go right here in the middle. And we will claim this hive. We can make some honey with what we have. Okay. And now we will try to find some flowers. So off to the right is the shop. And then out here we have flowers. Here's some fields here. So we can dig it. <laughs> okay. And when we dig, our backpack fills up, so. Okay. So this is kind of like the mining simulators, only this time the surface re regenerates. So you're never actually digging down. That's that's pretty cool. And then different flowers will give us different points. So okay. Okay, so we filled up our backpack. Come over here, we can make honey. And I don't think we've discovered anything yet. Okay. So we will go back over here. Let's check these red flowers. So those are a plus four as well. 
And when our B collects, he gives us plus 10. Oh, okay, and as we dig down, we get less and less. So fill up our backpack here. A sprout has appeared. So we have honey. I'd like to be able to find another. Look at oh, look at this person. They have a ton of bees. They've been playing this one for a while. <laughs> this is my first time checking this game out, but it does seem pretty cool. All I'm a big fan of the Roblox tycoons and the simulators. Those are usually the ones that I play the most. Blood Moon Tycoon has been a lot of fun. So I, there's not really a difference in value yet. Man, it's just, I guess once you stop collecting four, it's best to move on. And our backpack must be full. Yes. Wow, some of these people have a lot of bees. And a ton of honey. We're only at 800 and the number one person, Cutter Cakey, 96 million. That is insane. Oh, our pollen container's full. How'd that happen? I did make honey. Oh, maybe we have to wait. Okay. I probably left too soon. Okay. So there's that. We have a thousand honey. Let's check over here. Oh, we got a ladybug. That is not a good idea. So our bee is going to defend us, but I don't know how strong. Oh, he, okay. He's not too bad. We can't attack, which our bee is tough. There we go. And, uh oh, oh, there's our bee. Okay. I thought we lost our bee in the fall. Oh, and over here is plus six. So this is a better area to gather pollen and our bag is full so typically the first thing I like to do is upgrade my bag so I can carry a little bit more I don't know how much that's gonna cost so why don't we run over to the shop after we make our honey here and see what what things cost Okay, so let's head over here to the shop and see what we can buy, if anything, yet. So what do we have here? Let's open the shop. So for 650 honey, oh, I'm not, oh wait, no, back over there, okay. That holds up to 750 pollen. And we can't afford that. Obviously we can't afford that. So that's what we currently have. This we can get, collects two pollen from three patches in front of you in 0.7 seconds. Okay, so these items will help us dig faster. And that's a helmet. Belt pocket attaches to your waist to expand the size of your container. Basic boots collects pollen as you walk through the flowers. That's pretty cool. All right, so let's get this bag. And then we will leave the shop here. 
So now we can carry a little bit more and we can make honey a little bit faster. So let's go over here since we got that ladybug. I don't know how quickly they respawn. Okay, so this is only worth four. Hmm. Okay, so down to two. Maybe these double? Okay, the double flowers are worth six. So let's try to find those to fill our backpack a little bit quicker. And we're still collecting. Okay, now it's dropping down. There we go. Grab that one. Oh, no, over here. A little hard to aim. I guess it looks like you collect the block that you're standing on. Okay, now we're down to four. Oh, uh, maybe it was maybe they're all four. We were just we we're collecting two spots at once. Oh, I think I understand it now. So when you are on a let's try this really quick. So if we click the, Is our bag full? Oh, almost. Okay, let me go to I want to check something right here. We'll check this. Okay. So it looks like if you're next to a block that has two flowers, you get an extra two each time you dig. Oh, we gotta go back over here. And our bee can only take 200 at a time, so this unfortunately takes a little while. All right, while we're waiting, let's look up here. We have eggs, increases our bond with a bee by 10, increases our bond with a bee by 25. So we can, can we give this to our bee? No? Oh, we have to put it in the, there we go. So yes, let's give the strawberry to our bee. And we have quests, collect 5,000 pollen from the mushroom field. So that's our current quest. We've discovered one type of bee. So once we find these bees, we can put them in the honeycomb. We have badges. So this is collect 1 million honey, 10 quests, 100 battle points, 2,500 ability tokens. We have some system functions here. We have our shop, and then this is where you can spend your Robux if you want to. Okay, so let's go back over and collect some more honey. We are currently at 1300. So here's a block with two flowers. Oh, and he's giving us an extra, extra pollen. And I think I may have misspoke. I think I said collect some honey. <laughs> we are collecting pollen to turn into honey. Here's a spot with two. Okay. Let's see how our no, this one. Okay, so our backpack, we are at. It's hard to. No, that's not the one we want. We want to collect. 
There we go. Got to try to stand on that flower. And we'll fill up our bag and then I think we're going to go and buy that rake. So let's line this up so we can see how much we have. Okay, so let's go convert this into honey. And I'm, oh wow, look at that person with all their bees. I'm hoping we can find some bees like that. Okay, so now with, since we have a stronger bond, you can take a little bit more pollen from us. Okay, so we got that. Let's go collect some more. Maybe we can get ladybug back. What does this do? You need pollen to use the instant converter. Oh, we have another ladybug. There we go. I think our bee got him before he got us. Yes. Okay. So let's grab that. So it looks like they give us instant honey. We'll fill our backpack one more time before we go to the shop and then maybe we can buy something else. I don't usually like to buy the first tier of item we did with the backpack this time because there was a pretty big jump from 200 to 750. But typically I would save up and buy the next on any of the other simulators that I play. But it was worth a shot to see what it gave us. Okay, getting closer to 750. So, okay, let's go over this one. Oh, if we get two of these next to each other, we get eight. That's even better. Let's check our backpack. Okay, we're full. We have not found a bee yet, and I don't know if we get those by doing quests, maybe? So let's have our bee make us some honey. And since we only have one bee right now, I'm going to use this treat to make the bond a little bit stronger, so he'll help us a little bit more. All right, let's go. Oh, crap, he wasn't done yet. I thought he got the last bit of pollen from the backpack. Okay, there we go. Let's run over to the shop and we'll grab that rake. And you can see some, there's some more advanced levels up that way that you, where you can go. So we'll open the shop, we'll go so that one holds 3,500 pollen. That is, yep, so that's the next one. And that costs 5,500 honey, which we do not have. This is 22,000 honey for the canister. Holds up to 10,000 pollen. Okay. So the rake collects two pollen from three patches. For 2200, we can get the clippers, and that collects nine pollen from the patch in front of you. 
and that is 5,500. So let's grab that. We'll get the clippers and we'll leave the shop. And now we'll see what this can do for us. So let's find the double flower here. Okay. So we received a treat. Uh, okay, and this one can only do one, one block at a time. And it's the block in front of us, so we have to be aimed at it. So let's, we can find a double and we get 18 per double. So that's what we want to go for. And it does <laughs> collect pollen very quickly. I'm playing on PC. I looked this up on the Xbox One and I did not see this game. So this may be PC only. And our backpack's full. And it, so it appears from what we've seen, I, I don't, that number may be the bond that you and your bee have. So what do we, what did we get here? We got another treat. So we can try giving that to our bee. Okay, yep, and it bumped us up to a number three. And then you can see the three on their wings. All right, so that put us at 1448 honey. Let's go, or yeah, 1448 honey. Let's talk to this bear and see if it's the same quest that we have. Okay, so it's hi, I'm Black Bear. You look like a promising new honey maker. I happen to be a honey connoisseur. That means I know a lot about honey. And if you're willing to go through my training, you'll be making tons of honey in no time. First off, collect 100 pollen from the sunflower field. Oh, sunflower field right here. Let's do these quests and maybe that's how we'll get new bees. And a little bell goes off once you've reached your quest. Nice job, here's a reward. Come talk to me again when you're ready for another quest. So what did he give us? It looks like he maybe gave us 200 honey. He didn't, okay, and we still have the main one, collect 5,000 pollen from the mushroom field. So let's talk to him again. The pollen from each field produces slightly different honey. Most people can't tell the difference, but I can. That's why I love it here. There's a, such a variety of flower patches. Each field is different. Sunflowers, mushrooms, clovers. But today I've got a hankering for dandelion flavored honey. Why don't you collect some pollen from the dandelion field? 250 should be enough. So we can go to the dandelion field. That must be right here. So let's Okay, we got our quest. I'm hoping he gives us a B. Nice job, here's a reward. Come talk to me again when you're ready for another quest. So we got 400 honey that time. So we will talk to him again. Aren't bees amazing? They collect pollen, make honey, and even defend you from attackers. But did you know some bees are even more amazing than others? There are four classes of bees, basic, rare, epic, and legendary. Basic bees all look and act the same, but there are different types of rares, epics, and legendaries. And those all have special abilities. Some of them are faster or stronger. Some of them even create tokens that give you special boosts. Those bees are pretty hard to get in basic eggs. But a silver egg has a guaranteed chance of being at least a rare. If you complete my next few quests, I'll give you a silver egg. But don't expect it to be easy. 
first collect 500 pollen. Okay. Well, that is easy enough. So I wonder if it's going to be 500 total or 500 from not right now. So let's see what happens. Nope. Okay. So we got to collect an additional 500. Yeah, it's a little tricky to aim on this. So I guess I got to just turn around that way so I can see where I'm facing a little bit better. Okay, the bag's full. This detuned music is very strange. <laughs> okay, well, convert what was that? Oh, wow. Hold on. There's honey over here. It's like a honey storm. Let's go over here and grab what we can. Oh, wow. This is a nice little event. And then it all fades away. So you have a certain amount of time. All right, well, we're over here. Before we go back and make more honey, we might as well fill up our bag and work our way to 500 pollen. And we got our 500 pounds. So let's go over here and talk with the bear. Nice job. Here's a reward to hold you over. A few more quests and a silver egg is yours. That's right. No egg yet. You've got to work for it. All right. Let's, oh wait. Yeah, we got to do one more quest. But what is up here? Oh, what do we have here? Oh, are these... Maybe these are pets that we can have fly around with us. We can't afford any of them. They're tickets. So that is a ticket shop. So let's see what this bear wants us to do next. Oh, he's right over here. Three colors of flowers on this mountain. Red, white, and blue. If a bee is red, it collects twice as much pollen from red flowers. And if a bee is blue, it collects twice as much from blue flowers. Working in fields that match the color of your bees help you collect pollen faster. For my next request, I want you to collect 600 pollen from red flowers. All right, so let's go make our honey. And then we will collect pollen from red flowers. I was hoping he would say white because we have a white bee. I'm going to be really excited when we get our first bee. And let's look at our, we have a backpack, which is empty, so. Oh, vicious bee has been defeated. Okay, so there's boss fights. Okay, we have to find red flowers. So let's go to this double. And we'll just go with what we can find here in the red. And fortunately with these clippers, it doesn't take too long. And having that extra B will be very helpful. Oh, we don't want blue. So over here, there's many more red and a ladybug. So we need our bee to help us. Oh, our bag's full. Already, wow, that was quick. Oh, our bee must be sleeping. Oh no! Okay, now he's awake. So if we click on our bee, we can see his bond. Now that's interesting because we've given him treats and I thought his bond would have been higher than that. 
But I guess that's a number that we see on the on the honeycomb. So let's go get some more red flowers. And we can, I think we'll have one more quest to do for the bear and then we'll get the egg. And we got it. So let's let our bee take out the ladybug and we'll collect, oh. Get the honey from him. Then we'll go over here and collect the reward for, or at least the next quest from the bear. Nice job, here's a reward to hold you over. Two more quests and the silver egg is yours. Two more quests, okay. He gave us 650 honey, or yeah, 650 honey. Pollen from blue flowers has always tasted slightly minty to me. Brown bear tells me it's all in my head. He just doesn't have a refined taste palette like I do. Speaking of blue flowers, could you collect a thousand pollen from blue flowers for me? Okay, so now we have to find blue flowers. So we have some here. And our bag's gonna fill up for they're able to complete this quest. But we will get as much as we can and then come back and finish. What was that? Okay, so the music plays. I thought it might have been our bag being full. And now it's full, okay. So we will run over here, turn this into honey. So I see this guy's first bee would have been a level four. So you must have to play a little while before you get your first bee. And I don't know if you get your first bee from the bear or if you're able to get it from other places. Make this last little bit of honey and then we will run over here. And we're currently at 4,700, no, no, that's not. So we have 8,224. So we can actually upgrade some of our items, which will be good. It's a nice thing with doing quest because you don't really pay attention to how much you have. And then once you realize that you have enough to get some cooler items. So let's... Oh wait, what are we doing? We need blue. I'm over here still thinking of red. No. There we go. All right. Oh, what's that? Okay. And we'll go over here. There's a double blue. And over here. Maybe our bees. Why can't we get that? Oh, our bag must be full. Yeah, our bag's full. Let's go over here and make honey. Oh, what's what are those? Like marshmallows. So we're collecting blue flowers now, and then I imagine the last one will be white flowers, which will be good because our bee's gonna be a little bit faster on those. So we have this. He's grabbing the last 30.
and we'll come over here and collect some more blue flowers. Our be sad. Okay, we got enough for the quest. We have 8,974 honey. Let's... Nice job. Here's a reward to hold you over. One more quest and the silver egg is yours. Excellent. 750 honey. Variety is the spice of life. It's also the spice of honey. If you collect me pollen from a variety of flower fields, I'll give you my silver egg. I'll take a thousand pollen from the mushroom field, the clover field, and the blue flower field. So, before we do that, we are going to convert this pollen into honey, and then we're going to buy a better bag from the shop. So, our bee should be able to take all of that, yes. And we will run over here now. How are we with this quest? We should be getting close. Oh, that's off in the mushroom field, so we haven't done that yet. All right, let's open the shop and we will get this bag here. And this will hold 3,500, which is very good. And that leaves us with 4,435. All right, so our current quest, collect a thousand pollen from the mushroom field. So let's go over to the mushroom field. We gotta watch out for the ladybugs. And it could be any flower, so we will And where's our bee? Where's our bee? <laughs> oh, okay. So I don't, I don't see a, that's interesting. Cause I'm not seeing, maybe I'm missing it, but I don't see a health bar anywhere for us. And they did say that if the, if we get attacked and we die, then we lose all of our pollen. So. We have to be careful there, but I don't see a health bar. But we will get our thousand honey here. Or <laughs> I keep saying honey, thousand pollen here, which won't take us too long at this rate, which is good. And we'll get that. All right, so let's check our quest. Okay, now we need a thousand from the clover field. And the clover field, where is the clover field? Oh, over here, okay. We haven't even been up there yet. So let's go check out this clover field. So ladders, just walk into them and you'll run right up. Oh, there's a lot of double flowers over here. Oh, and there's a bigger bug. Oh, there's two of them. Oh, we gotta be careful. Our bee, oh no, our bee needs to focus on one of them. All right. And we gotta jump to get these. I don't know what's going on with our... Okay. That scared me. Oh. And we'll get this. And we don't get a... S and There's no bell that goes off when we do just part of the quest. So we have to check once we reach about 2100 here to see if we
So let us check our quests. Oh, close to it. We need just a little bit more. All right. And so we have that. And then a thousand pollen from the blue flower field. And if we can find that. So the blue flower field. Oh, we got another rhino beetle. Oh, but he's got a ton of bees. They'll wipe that out. Here's the blue flower field down here. We can just drop down it. Oh, we got a bug. <laughs> Let's get our bee down here to help us. And we will start collecting. Oh no, our bee's tired. He went away. And we can't fight. He is hitting us. I, it flash. Oh, we got to run. Oh no, okay, we're right up there. I see our health bars just up on the top. So maybe these guys will just be a distraction for us. Nope. Oh. Gotta keep an eye on our. Oh no! <laughs> I definitely don't wanna lose our. There we go. Okay. Oh yeah, we didn't. We didn't. I don't wanna take. I don't wanna steal their stuff. Oh, they're gonna leave it for us. That was very nice of them. And our bee is back. So we will fill up our backpack here and that will give us everything we need to finish this quest and then get our first bee. Something just blew up. Oh, it got dark. I don't know what's going on. So let's fill up our backpack. We must have to go to one more field. Oh, there we go. We did it. So let's, there we go. Our bag is full. Quest is complete. So let's run back over here. And we'll go and get our egg first. We're at 5,151 honey. Impressive. With your dedication, I trust the bee that hatches from this silver egg will go on to become a fine honey maker. Here you go. Excellent. So what does he have for us now? You've proven yourself to be a fine beekeeper. From here on out, I'll give you much harder tasks to complete. If you complete 10 of them, I'll give you a gold egg. A gold egg always hatches into an epic or legendary bee. So, you ready for a real challenge? Collect 4,000 pollen from the bamboo field. Alright, so I imagine the bamboo field is much more difficult. So, let's go over here. And look in our, maybe in our eggs. Silver egg. So, let's put him right next to our bee there. And we got a bomber bee. This crafty bee makes bombs which collect pollen from all nearby flowers. Very nice. And we will close that. We have 11 gumdrops while standing in a field to co cover flowers and goo. Goo grants bonus honey, okay. So let's give a treat to the bomber bee and then we will also give this blueberry to the bomber bee. Okay, and then we'll do our honey. And this part's gonna take a little while. So we have our second bee, and we need to collect 4,000 pollen. So we're gonna have to figure out the best way to get eggs here. And I don't know if they only come from quests or if we eventually get them from the fields, so. We will find out soon enough. And these guys are just finishing up with the pollen. So we will have to try out these gumdrops sometime too and see how they work. But here we go. And that gives us, let's see. So we have 8,127. And 
now with the last batch that puts us up at 8,651 honey. So let's run to the shop one more time. And we will see what we can buy. So let's get this. So the next canister is at 22,000. We can get the magnet. Collects two pollen from nine surrounding patches. Nine surround, okay. And then 14,000 for the vacuum. The helmet's 30,000, 14,000. Boots, 4,400. Oh, and that requires ingredients. So let's get this magnet. And now we can exit out of the store. X, okay. So with that, we're gonna stop here and join me for the next round where we try out this magnet and collect some more pollen so we can get more bees. And we'll figure this game out as we go. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.